yeah. This place was really something special. Our time in Colombia this trip was coming to an end, so our moments together were becoming more and more important. The Atma Eco Village in El Pongo certainly provided us some thrills and an overall fantastic experience. It was a long and bumpy dirt road navigating the hilltops to get down to this place, but once you found it on the edge of that lake in Guatape El Pinol, this was a little taste of paradise, and it was worth beating the shit out of that rental car to get here. The villa we chose was about the finest they had to offer. It had that private dock down there where the jet skis came, but you really can't go wrong with anything that this place has to offer. And you can never go wrong with a hot tub out on the deck with a fire, looking at the moonlight and the stars. And you can see that luxury inside there. This place was just simply money. No life like the good life. Ah yeah. And the food, absolutely forget about it. I think I had those quesadillas about three times while we were there for two days. But the frijolada, anything you got, fantastic. And even better when you eat with views and company like this. And after dinner, a little more time in the hot tub. Ah uh, yeah. You know how we both love these jet skis and they brought them right to the villa for us and uh, off we went to explore the same lake that we did earlier in the year. If you look back into the video library, which you should and watch all my Columbia videos from uh, February and January. And if you remember way back in the library, jet skis were our first date operating in the outdoor video. Uh, so we always love getting on these jet skis wherever we go. So we didn't make it out to Pablo Escobar's party path this time, but you can see that in one of our previous Colombia videos from February. But I always love the scenery of this Piedra del Pinol, and you can also see we climbed that thing earlier in the year. And on the way back in to the docks, there was this family of ducks just adding to the ambiance. And then we had a couple drinks, sat at the deck bar here. Ah, yeah. Another fantastic experience in a fantastic place with a fantastic lady. And if you do find yourself here, there's no way you can't go on that swing. That swing is absolutely money. And I think I shit myself more on this thing than I did on the parapente that we did the day before. And apologize for the thin video here, this one was made for Instagram, but you can see how they strap you in and then hoist you up and then you shit yourself before it comes time for them to release you into the sky. And then some people scream loud enough to get everybody's attention on the hillsides and you can hear them all laughing echoing through the uh, valley here. Absolutely classic moments from the life of BFC. You're live. And I love how she says, don't post on Instagram, I say you're live, and she's like, okay. But like I said, this thing's such a thrill, you gotta take advantage of it if you go to the Atma Eco Villas. Ah, uh, yeah. I'll close you out here with some footage we took for Instagram, but this is the bubble glamp site. There's different themes and different styles of villas here. Uh, so you have your pick varying prices too. Of course, a Buddha is always a plus. So we'll tour our villa now. This is a staircase from the villa. It goes down to the private dock down there. We had a couple meals, dinner, there's a fireplace there. Of course, the jet skis pull up. Absolutely money. So after you're done taking a look at our villa here, you get a bonus clip of her telling me to shut my mouth when I'm eating. Classic. Ah, uh, yeah. What did you say, baby? Because you are eating and I can't hear you, so please close your mouth. <laughs> These enchiladas were so freaking good, maybe I was opening my mouth a little bit too much. But I get. Yeah. <laughs>